Welcome to today's edition of Crypto Corner at InvestorIdeas.com. News on what's driving the cryptocurrency market. Hello everyone, this is Sam Mowers here and welcome to episode 606 of the Crypto Corner podcast. For news today, Bitcoin has lost about 13% of its trading price just in the last 24 hours. Square is considering a Bitcoin hardware wallet and DMG has announced a strategic investment into Brain Capital. But just before we get into the show today, a quick reminder that if you enjoy this podcast, to please feel free to share it or leave us a review. And as always, I recommend checking out some of the other podcasts on InvestorIdeas.com. This includes the Clean Tech and Climate Change podcast, the Cannabis podcast, as well as many others, all of which will bring you up to speed on the latest stock news and trends in their respective spaces. All right, so after a tough enough last couple of weeks, Bitcoin has now plummeted roughly 13%. In the past 24 hours, this is according to data from CoinMarketCap. At the time of recording, it is trading for approximately 31,430 USD. Data from analytics from CoinShares via an article today on Cointelegraph indicates that Bitcoin investment products saw a record outflow of $141 million this past week. An excerpt from the Cointelegraph article by writer Brian Quarmby reads, quote, The data follows heavy institutional selling amid May's dramatic crypto market meltdown, with institutions having withdrawn nearly $100 million from crypto products between May 10th and May 16th before outflows briefly slowed toward the end of last month, end quote. However, Peter Kozyakov, the co-founder and CEO of global payment network Mercurio told Coindesk, quote, Investors appear to be storing their assets in hardware wallets with anticipation that the current drop in price will balance out for new price runs toward and above its previous all-time high. With Bitcoin in DeFi, investors get to maximize their earnings amidst dwindling prices, a better option for many who prefer not to keep their assets idle. End quote. Square Inc., which trades on the NYSE under the ticker symbol SQ, might be building a hardware Bitcoin wallet, according to some recent tweets from CEO Jack Dorsey. Quote, Square is considering making a hardware wallet for Bitcoin. If we do it, we would build it entirely in the open from software to hardware design and in collaboration with the community. End quote. And later on in the tweet thread, quote, Cash App integration is obvious for us, but only part of the solution. A smooth experience likely depends on a custom-built app, but it doesn't need to be owned by Square. We can imagine apps that work without Square, and maybe also without permission from Apple and Google." End quote. DMG Blockchain Solutions Inc., which trades on the TSXV under the ticker symbol DMGI, has announced a strategic investment of $3 million into Ottawa-based cryptocurrency and digital asset custodian Brain Capital. That's Brain spelled B-R-A-N-E. Sheldon Bennett, DMG's CEO, explained, quote, DMG considers Brain to be a unique and promising company in the global crypto custody space, and we're excited about the opportunities this investment will achieve for both companies. DMG and Brain share strong commitments to innovation, integrity, and sustainability. This new partnership will position both companies as setting new standards of excellence in the Bitcoin sector. End quote. That does it for today's Crypto Corner. If you would like to be a guest or sponsor for this podcast, contact InvestorIdeas.com. Investor Ideas reminds all listeners to read our disclaimers and disclosures on the InvestorIdeas.com website. And this podcast is not an endorsement to buy products, services, or securities. Investors are reminded all investment involves risk and possible loss of investment. To hear more InvestorIdeas.com podcasts, please visit InvestorIdeas.com slash audio. And a reminder, you can also hear our podcasts on Apple Podcasts, Audible, Spotify, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio, Google Play Music, and most audio platforms available.